it's Vlogmas day number four. My hair is crazy this morning. Probably because I didn't wash it for like a day or so. And now it's like, what is life? Look at that. Look like a crazy person. <laughs> Alright, let's open the zoom zooms. <laughs> He's like, no, you can't see it. Well, I could see what it was before you could that yesterday. Oh, I think it's Donald. He like destroyed that door. He's stuck. How is he stuck? He's stuck. He's so fat. He's so fat. <laughs> he like destroyed the door. Here, go back to sleep. <laughs> go back to sleep. Is he sliding on something? A tube. He's sliding on a tube. You're so cute. <laughs> oh my god, her yesterday. Are you hungry? You're always hungry, Kiki. Like Hulk, you're always angry, you're always hungry. Ooh, let us open day number four. Not really open, it's more like slide it over. He will be great. <laughs> be called son of the highest. The Lord God will give him the throne of his father, David. I don't know why I'm reading it like that. He <laughs> will rule Jacob's house forever. No end to his kingdom. Luke 1, 32 through 33. Good morning, guys. We're back. Finally got my tripod and my bag into the car. <laughs> Took a while. Funny story, it actually smells like Christmas trees in here because, um... One of my shirts, um, I forgot to wash, and so it smells a little. I'm gonna wash it today, don't worry. Um, but like, I spritz it with some, some Febreze, and the Febreze we have smells like Christmas trees. So now, not only does my shirt smell of Christmas trees, but the car now smells of Christmas trees. So that's funny. Um, but anyway, I have decided today that, um, that uh, I'm going to do kind of like a countdown bridal diaries. I am going to try and do it. Um, mind you, as we get closer and closer, it's gonna get crazier and crazier. My mom and I have already discovered that. Um, but like every week, starting this week, um, I'm gonna try and post like a countdown, like five weeks, four weeks, three weeks, two weeks, the week of, you know, type of a thing. Um, just to like to let you guys know what steps I'm going through um, for the wedding. So, yay! I am probably gonna have it because that's something that I want to be like currently updated. Um, I'm want, gonna want to have it be like the week of, like I film it and post it type of the day of or the week of type of a thing. So it's probably up already by the time you guys see this. Um, and fun fact, as of tomorrow, we are th less than 30 days away from the wedding. That is right. As of tomorrow, we are a month away from the wedding, which I say that and like my brain is not letting me like grasp the concept of what it truly means just because my first initial thought is to panic. Um, but like <laughs> I FaceTimed my mom yesterday and um, I and we were going over decorations and things and like because I don't want them to take a whole because they're bringing stuff down I don't want them to bring a ton of stuff down because they already have so much stuff that they're going to bring down as it is um, uh, including some of our gifts and stuff like that but like I also don't want I've realized that we have collected quite a lot um, and that I'm not gonna want to keep everything I mean I wish I could keep a lot of the things because a lot of things we have like statues and um, little door hanger things and stuff like that like or table set things um, I would love to keep them but the problem is is I don't really have any place to put them currently um, 
you know, we have a small apartment and there's only so much space for what we have. So it's going to be really interesting. I may end up donating a lot to like Goodwill and stuff, which is fine, I guess. I'm um, giving it to somebody who will really want it or really use it. Um, but like, I'm kind of frustrated with myself because I didn't want to get to that point of we have so much I'm going to have to give it away or throw it away. Luckily a lot of our decorations um, are very like cheap um, and or it's like glass and so we can recycle it um, or just you know throw it away and or it can get used again like I know there's some tool that I may end up keeping um, if it doesn't get damaged so but um but yeah that's what I pretty much decided to do um, today I am going to work I have a six and a half hour shift which means I'm working for six hours and I get a 30 minute break yay um, and um, I'm starting I'm not opening I'm starting at 1130 and I'm out at six so I'm not opening and I'm not closing. I haven't had this kind of shift at Frozen in a long time. If it wasn't for the fact that it's so short, I could probably ER. I mean, I probably could still ER, but because I'm working so little hours as is and the shift is so short, I, I'm not gonna bother with it. The funny thing is I told people a couple days ago, and I knew this was gonna come and bite me in the butt, I told people a couple days ago that I asked off a lot of days in December and I wasn't sure what I was gonna need off and what I'm like gonna need to, what days I'm going to need to pick up shifts and so I was like if you guys need to give away shifts go ahead and let me know um and I said that because we're very understaffed so a lot of people aren't able to give away shifts because there's not enough people and and so far like every schedule drop now I've had so many people be like can you take this shift can you take that shift well yesterday I sat down and I did my planner planning for the month of December and I pretty much have like almost every single day off that I know that I have off I have something planned whether it's going out and getting like our wedding license or we're getting our hair cut this week and other things like for the wedding and so I've discovered that I'm probably gonna need those days off and I'll just extend my hours on days that I am actually working so anyway I'm rambling now I'll see you guys in the park I'm leaving because she leaves not that far from where I come on the stage at the front and they just closed the gate. That's awesome. Something I didn't talk about because I was driving. Um, the construction for Star Wars Land, they have a tall mountain, I'm assuming that's what it is that they're working on, and it looks like super, super tall. And they've got a, an American flag up there. Not only that, but they have a tiny little Christmas tree up there as well. And I think that's the highest point in Galaxy's Edge right now. But it's just so cute how they put a little Christmas tree right next to the American flag. I love it. This is what we call a show dump. You know, when the theater opens the doors and lets about a thousand people out at one time. I just need to get back over there. There we go. Finally got a clearing. It's a miracle. <laughs> so today it was actually not very bad. Um, there was, oh, I just reached my step goal. Yay, me. Um, <laughs> today wasn't bad. Like there were a couple moments where I got some people that were like, just a little like agitated for what seemed like no reason. Um, but it wasn't too bad. I ended up actually extending 30, out, 30 minutes, 30 hours, oh my God, no, 30 minutes um, because our coordinator, um, I mean, I love our coordinators anyway, but one of our coordinators is a, a relatively like, good friend of mine, and he said that he was really short, and he's like, can you please extend 30 minutes? And I was like, I mean, I do need the hours, and 30 minutes isn't like a long time, so I'm having issues finding my keys. Give me a second. Baby kitty, were you locked in the bedroom? Literally, I just came home, opened the door, and she's just sitting here. Baby kitty. Moreno is right. You can go now. Or you could stay. It's up to you. You could stay here if you'd like. Oh, poor baby girl. Alrighty, so I had some stir fry for dinner. It was very yummy. I've become kind of addicted to stir fry, I think. And now 
I am, oh, and I also did some video editing. I had caught up on all of my videos, and now I'm currently uploading them. For whatever reason, the internet is super slow. I've been working on this one video for probably about 15 minutes or more now, and it's almost, finally almost done. Um, but because that's still going, I am going to um, do a little workout. So, uh, yeah, we're going to... See, because I haven't been working out, and I'm very upset about it because I literally have no excuse. So I've had last, the last two days off, like, no excuse whatsoever. So now I'm going to do a workout, and I should tell myself that I need to go for a two-mile jog. Just a two-mile jog, um, because I have to, like, build back up to three miles because of my hip. Um, did I just see, yep. <sighs> Jared's not going to be happy about that. There are ants literally all over his end table and all over his cup. That is another issue that I will have to deal with later. So I'm about to hop in the shower and I wanted to check to make sure that the video that I was uploading uploaded and I couldn't find it anywhere because I was going to upload another one. Come to find out, I uploaded it to the wrong channel. I uploaded my vlog to my gaming channel because I forgot that the setting was still set to that when I was uploading all of the overcooked festive videos. Gosh dang it, now I have to start all over. So I took a shower after my workout, cleaned up the little ant issue as much as I can. I like took care of his milk cup that was covered in ants and wiped down the end table and stuff like that so I also spritzed where I think they're coming from with peppermint oil and water which I've been told helps and what else did I do oh I also spritzed the area where he had as well with it so hopefully that helps um Jared finished two finals Yay! And now we're gonna play Pokemon. Almost said Pokemon Go. That's funny. We're gonna play Pokemon for a little bit. And um, then I have to go to bed. So I say good night, Jared. Good night, Jared.